Hey folks, it's Austin here with Southwest Florida Auto. Today I'm doing the video walk around for our 1999 Mercury Sable. Absolutely perfect condition. Um, mechanically, cosmetically, it does have a couple of flaws. As you notice up here on the front, um, the bumper is a little scuffed up. Okay, but the hood is in excellent condition. Headlights are in great shape, as well as the grill. I'll let that focus. Okay, and another cosmetic flaw that I noticed right away is a small little dent, um, probably two inches wide um, in both directions, uh, going across, and then as well as a little bit of a scuff. So aside from those two things, the car's in excellent shape, um, cosmetically speaking. Mechanically, it's 100%. Um, it's a 99, only has 120, I think 3,000 miles on it. And we'll get into the exact number once we get into the car itself. But this side, excellent condition. Um, tires, all four are matching, and you're sitting at about 80 to 90 percent tread life left so they're almost brand new tires all four rims are in decent shape there's a little corrosion around the mercury logo um, on all four sides um, but the rim itself is an absolutely beautiful condition okay let's make my way around to the back another little cosmetic flaw up here we've got a little paint chip going on on the trunk lid itself okay pop the hood for you Nice key fob, keyless entry. That is also nice. Nice big trunk. Mercury Sable is definitely known for that as well. As a spare tire, jack, and other tools you need to uh, change tire on the fly. Um, it isn't a full size tire. Obviously, it is a donut, but it will at least get you out of a tough spot. Okay. And here we are back around on this side. I'll go ahead and hop into the interior now, show you how good a condition this is actually in. All four door panels are absolutely beautiful, um, as you saw in the pictures, as well as the seats themselves. Um, minimal wear, there is, you know, you can definitely tell it is a 99, but there isn't any cracking in the leather, any rips um, or tears. So that's nice. It is a two-tone interior, kind of a dark brownish uh, uh, color, and then a lighter brown as well. Okay, insert. Carpet's absolutely beautiful. Okay. As well as the headliner, still stuck up there. The heat and humidity down here in Florida really does a number on the interiors of a lot of cars. This one, fortunately, um, tells me it's been garage kept and not beat up. Okay. Door panel, again, excellent condition. You got power windows, power mirrors, and locks down here. Um, all levers are intact, everything like that. Front carpets, absolutely perfect. They match the back. Front seats as well, very minimal wear here. Um, even the bolsters going along the sides, you know, getting in and out of the cars, usually there's a lot of breakdown in the interior foam um, on the seats. These, however, are absolutely perfect. Okay. Another, another door panel. And the dash, absolutely perfect. No sun damage there either, so that's nice. Okay, yeah, we're sitting at 123,465 miles. So for a 99, that is not incredibly high. Um, to just now be breaking 120,000 miles, that's pretty good. Let me go ahead and start it up for you. Okay, you got AM, FM. I don't know if you can hear me over the fan running. You got nice ice cold air conditioning. Go ahead and turn that down so you can hear me. Okay, it's nice, all electronic. Um, Unfortunately, you don't have a CD player. It is just the tape deck. Um, you have a nice glove box storage bin there. Um, and again, also a nice sunroof. Okay, nice features. Everything works on it. Um, tilts up and down, as well as slides back. Okay, so that's good. Um, let me go ahead and open the trunk for you. Open the hood. I'm sorry. I don't know why I called it a trunk. Okay. This is the Duratec 24 valve V6. Um, decently clean engine bay here. Obviously, it has a relatively newer battery. That's good. Still crank starts up every time like it should. But mechanically, it runs like a watch. Definitely in great shape. It's been well taken care of, well serviced. Maintenance has definitely been done on the vehicle. Okay, so if you have any questions, there should be a link in the comments section below. It'll take you over to our website. Um, and then 
our website, you'll see a list of our entire inventory. So if this car wasn't um, your cup of tea or you saw something you didn't like, there's plenty of other cars here on the lot you can take a look at. Um, but if you have any questions regarding this particular vehicle or any of the other ones on the website, um, there should be some contact information there as well. Um, so thank you. Again, I'm Austin, and I'm, I'm with Southwest Florida Auto.